So in this video, we are going to flash the Marauder firmware on this ESP32 chip of our 3-in-1 multi-board. Uh, so you have to go to this link, uh, which is esp.huhn.me. So this is the site. Over here, you have to flash your uh, ESP32 module. Uh, so we need few files. So first of all, we need this firmware file. Uh, which you can download from this uh, github link i will provide this github link in the resources file uh, or in the description and you have to download this bin file uh, which has flipper at the end so over here you can see flipper.bin so you have to download this file and few of the other files which i will provide on the uh, on the description so let's just start so first we have to connect our board with uh, with our uh, system so let me connect my board so over here, if you can see, there is a BT button, which is for boot. So we have to hold this button and make sure your uh, micro SD card is also connected with your uh, board. So I have already connected my micro SD card and let me just press this uh, button and the boot button and let me connect. And it's connected and make sure you are on ESP32 over here. You can see the indication, the green light indication means we are on ESP32 and now you can release your boot button and over here over here in the connect you will see esp32 pair so let me just pair it and it's connected and we have to select few files and i will provide these files in the uh, in the description so first of all uh, we have to select the bootloader.bin file right and then we have to select the partition file which is also a bin file and make sure you select these files in the correct order right so the order matters over here and then there is a boot underscore app zero bin and at the last we have to load our uh, flipper zero uh, 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 firmware which is over here and let's just hit program button and let's just continue so over here you can see it's flashing and it might take uh, one to two minutes so over here you can see uh, the flashing is complete 100 percent so over here you can see it says done so to run this firmware please reset your device so we have to just disconnect and connect with our flipper zero so if you see some errors over here uh, during flashing all you have to do is you just have to reconnect your uh, boot uh, you have to reconnect your uh, board with your uh, with your web interface uh, by pressing this boot button and you have to start this process again so sometime it uh, shows error uh, you have to, to try it um, more than once right so our bootloader is uh, finished let's just see this uh, on our uh, on our flipper zero as well so let me disconnect and let me connect it my flipper zero and let's just start and we have to go in if you can see uh, in gpios and over here you can see esp and over here you can see all the options which we can use with this esp32 and over here you can see wi-fi scanner and all those things right so this is our three-in-one multi-board for flipper zero Thank you.